Hi everybody, uh, welcome to another Saw review, and, um, today is Saw 4, uh, so Saw 4, um, this came out 2007, which is not bad, but I love the character Mark Hoffman in this fucking movie, I, I just love his, like, fucking performance, like, the guy that played him, so fucking good, but, in the very beginning, or I'm just gonna remember what I remember, I haven't watched this movie in forever, so, you got the, um, you got the scene where, um, Jigsaw, like, they, um, the, um, car, car, or how, however you say the place where they cut open dead bodies, and they had this whole part where he's, like, dead, and they cut his dead body open, and you get to the, like, colon, and they open this thing, and there's a, literally a cassette tape in it, and Mark Hoffman finds it, and then, next thing you know, Mark Hoffman ends up getting kidnapped, I know it's not part of, I'm not, I know it's, like, further in the movie, but I'm just trying to remember what I say, like, remember what's part of the movie, but, Let's get to the kills, though, but there's one kill where the girl ends up getting her tits ripped off. Fucking wow. Um, there's actually also a rapist in this fucking movie. And there's a little part where, um, this girl's fucking hair is, like, like, literally, it's getting scalped, and it's gonna rip her skull off, which is nasty as fuck. But, um, I'm trying to remember as hard as my fuck as I fucking can. I want to just get these out of the way. Then you get to the part where, um, Mark Hoffman and Donnie Wahlberg, which she survived. And, um, Donnie Wahlberg is literally uh, with his foot on ice, and Mark Hoffman's on the thing. Um. Well, he's literally tied up. So, um, next thing you know, um, someone breaks in. Um, Donnie Wahlberg's head ends up getting smashed by two ice blocks. Then, I guess Mark Hoffman ends up living because I guess he kills the guy. I don't fucking know, man. But, and you get. Um, flashback scenes between Jigsaw and his wife, and this man, like, where he has to put his fucking face through his fucking knives, and it's fucking gnarly as shit, and, you yeah, have this whole part where, um, Mark Hoffman gets tied up, and Jigsaw is talking to him, and then, Jigsaw lets him go, which, is a I like it in my opinion. And there's another part where um the guy's eyes are showed shut and there's another guy's eye um mouth showed shut which is fucking oh and um one of them has to die so the fat guy ends up dying because they're getting dragged towards the fucking thing. But Okay, what else? What else? Um, there, oh yeah, there's another part where they have the school sequence, and the parents have these fucking large rods through their fucking body, and they're like, one's on the other side, one's on the other side, like, they have to pull it out, literally. It's nasty as fuck, but they end up dying from it anyways, but, um, I'm trying to remember, I'm sorry if I'm being like this, but, alright, let me, let me go to the ending, so the black guy gets there, and then I guess Mark Hoffman ends up killing him, and the tape plays, and then I think in the fifth movie, it turns out Mark Hoffman's working for Jigsaw, but, <clears throat> but the ending, it's alright, but, 
Well, overall, the movie is not bad, but I do love Mark Hoffman. No homo, but... Yeah. So, that's my review on Saw 4. But, um, yeah. Thank you for listening to me.